Hey everyone, my name is Svetlana and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be reviewing for you a new concealer from Makeup Revolution. And it's Bright Eye Illuminating Under Eye Concealer. It's formulated to target under eye circles, offering flexible, buildable coverage with the max level of heat vitamin C to actively treat the area as you conceal. This is one of their newest concealers. I have been using it for almost two weeks and I absolutely love it. I will be applying it today so I can show you. But first, I wanna just tell you a little bit about it. It's 0.10 fluid ounces for only $10, which is really affordable. It does have a sponge as an applicator, so all you have to do, just twist it right in here. I got it in the color light, and I'm gonna show it to you right in here first. And it's for fair skin tones with neutral undertones. It does look a little more yellowish on my hand right now, but when I apply the foundation and the rest of the makeup, it looks actually pretty good and it does brighten my under eye area as well. I just wanna get it just tiny, tiny bit closer so you can see it's very light texture. It does have a little bit of that illuminating effect, which looks absolutely beautiful for under eye area. This concealer can be used to conceal blemishes, some redness if you have that, and erase under eye bags or any imperfection that you might have under your eye area. You can brighten your T-zone. You can do everything that you do with a regular concealer. Let's just go ahead and start applying this product because I feel like most people People are here just for that, just to see how it works, the color, the texture, and everything else. So I'm gonna use one eye, and what I've been doing, I'm probably gonna squeeze just a little bit of product. And since my sponge is pretty dirty already, you're not gonna be able to see um, the product coming out. But what I like to do is just kind of dab it under my eye area. And do you see how much lighter that is than on my hand? This is completely different color right in here. I think I might need just a little bit more. And then we're gonna do the other eye right away. And I actually been liking to apply this concealer quite a bit of it because it's super lightweight, it's very creamy formula, and it's non-drying, which is perfect for my under eye area. As you can see, I do have some fine lines, and unfortunately, every concealer does creases under my eye area. Even if it has the fullest coverage, it will still crease when I'm using very light concealers like that. It creases, but it doesn't make my under eye area look very droopy and kind of heavy. And this one just kind of brightens up and lightens up my under eye area, and that's it. And then I'm gonna use brush to smooth it out. And look at that. Look how easy it's blending. If you have more of an aging skin, if you have really dry under eye area, this concealer is absolutely perfect. And if you do like more of a lightweight coverage, then this concealer might be for you as well. And for $10, I think you cannot beat that. That's it. Look how easy it was just to use this concealer and to blend it out. Let's do the other eye. And I really like the color. When I'll apply the rest of the makeup, you'll be able to see that it's actually not as light and it just looks so super pretty. And I have been applying more of a darker uh, CC cream lately. I'm not sure why. I feel like I'm ready for summer and I want more of that golden skin. So here it is. This is how easy it was to apply this concealer 
and I think it looks absolutely beautiful. It's very lightweight. I love the texture. I love the consistency, but I also like how well it covers all of the imperfections without giving my eyes the dry look and the heaviness that a lot of concealers do when I tend to use more of a medium to full coverage concealers. I don't usually set my under eye area with the powder because it does accentuate my fine lines and everything else. I avoid a line uh, powder under my eyes. I'm gonna go ahead, finish up the rest of the look, and then I'm gonna come back in a couple of hours and I'm gonna show you how this concealer performing. So here it is, my friends. I did finish uh, the rest of the makeup. I didn't apply too much makeup today and I didn't want to do anything with my under eye area like I didn't want to apply any eyeshadows or not even much mascara. I just want you to see how this concealer looks. I will be coming back in a couple of hours so I can show you. It will always crease right underneath right in there. It doesn't really matter what concealer I'm using as long as it doesn't look cakey, as long as it doesn't look very dry and stays kind of very nice and bright. That's what I like about the concealers and this is just my preference and that's what I like. This is a very, very awesome concealer. I'm so happy that I decided to try it out. I would give this concealer 10 out of 10. The price is perfect. I really like the color that I chose. The consistency is great. It does brighten the under eye area. It's super creamy. It's very lightweight, but it looks absolutely beautiful. It's been about six and a half hours and I just wanted to get on and show you my under eye area and how the concealer uh, looking. Uh, you can see just a little bit, a little bit of crease in my fine lines, but that's what happens with every single concealer. I think it looks really, really good still. I didn't do any touch up. I didn't put any more. This is just how it looks about six and a half hours. And I didn't set my under eye area as well. So for all of that information, I feel like this Concealer is absolutely beautiful. It's super lightweight. It looks really good. I love the color that I chose and everything else. I'm just going to get a tiny, tiny bit closer so you guys can see it. I think it looks really good. I absolutely love this concealer. I've been using it for the last two weeks and I love it. That's it for this video guys. If you liked it, make sure to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for my weekly videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next one. Bye-bye.